best subject lines for emails, how to write them, and the two key steps to massive success. Hi everybody, Joe Barclay here from joebarclay.com. Coming to you again from our home on beautiful Loon Lake in the Adirondacks of Northern New York. And in this short video, I want to share how to write the very best subject lines for your emails, and I'll go over the two key steps for massive success. It's actually easy and straightforward. And before we get going, if you are new to my YouTube channel, be sure to click the subscribe button right now and hit the notification bell too, because I post new videos every week and I want to be sure you get the information. Also, I hope you'll support my YouTube channel and give this video a thumbs up. Hit the like button also to let YouTube know that this is the kind of content you like. Here's the thing. It really doesn't matter how good your offer is. It really doesn't matter how good your email content is if the email does not get opened and read. And the subject line is a key part of that. And yes, there are other elements that must be in place too. Even before you write and send an email, you need to be using an email address from your own domain, and you need to be sure the domain is set up properly. You need to be mailing to a good list you have generated yourself the right way, and you need to be sending content that your list is wanting. Do not waste your time or tarnish your reputation by sending spam. Lastly, you need to know how to craft emails that will make it into your subscribers inbox rather than the promotions tab or the dreaded spam folder. These are all topics in themselves that will be covered in upcoming videos. So again, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel now so you don't miss them. So for this video, I'm going to use an email I sent to my list last week as an example. I was sharing a recent blog post. And if you've not been there, I invite you to check out my blog at joebarclay.com. There's a link down below in the description. It's all about helping you create financial freedom via online marketing. This particular email got an excellent open rate of just over 41%. Depending on whose figures you look at, open rates are only around 20% on average. To craft the subject line, I started by getting a few ideas together and then brought up one of the online headline analyzer tools. There are several to choose from. It's important to note that they are not the final answer, just a good starting point to help get to the best subject line for your email. For this subject line, I used the headline analyzer by Monster Insights. So let's head over to the computer and check it out. Okay, this is the site at Monster Insights. Like I said, there are several to choose from and they all work similarly. I like this one best as it tracks your recent score history, makes it real easy to work with. Um, to use it, you enter a subject line and then click Analyze. So I started with this subject line, how to change your life in 30 minutes daily. I hit Analyze and it brought up a score of 53. And again, it's not so much the number I'm looking for, I'm using it to compare one subject line with another. You know, which one scores better? So I started with this one, got the score 53. The word lifestyle, I don't think it's a spam trigger, but it seems to make more of my emails go into the promotions tab. So I wanted to get rid of it. So I changed the subject line and went to change your life in 30 minutes daily. And the score shot up to 68. Next, I tried how to change your life in 30 minutes and got a score of 93. That's cool. But I felt it was important to not mislead people so I made a slight change and went with how to change your life in 30 minutes a day and still got a score of 91. Lastly, I tried how to change your life in 30 minutes daily and got a score of 93. So I had it down to where I think I wanted to kind of split test these two subject lines here. Again, this score thing, it's not the number, it's just kind of comparing one with the other. So I wanted to split test them before I emailed my list. By split testing, I'll know for sure which one's the one that's going to pull the best. Okay, I'm back. Let's talk about split testing. Most autoresponders can quickly set up what is called A-B split testing. This is where you test one email element. In this example, we are testing subject lines, testing one against another. The autoresponder I use and highly recommend called MailerLite makes it super simple. I'll include a link down below so you can try MailerLite out for free. I think you'll like it. So I kept everything the same except for the two subject lines. This is critical. Only test one element at a time. To start, you choose the size of the list you want to mail to. For example, you can mail 20% of your list one subject line, 
and 20% of your list the other, and then the system will automatically mail the remaining 60% of your list the best one. How cool is that? So those are the two key steps. Analyze subject lines to get the ones you think are best, and then split test them so you know for sure. I hope this short video helps you write the best subject lines for your emails. Feel free to reach out to me with any questions. You can read this and many more marketing tips at my blog at joebarkley.com. While you're there, be sure to pick up a copy of my free ebook. It will show you how to cut years off the learning curve and take the fast track to success by copying what works. And to stay up to date with my latest videos and proven marketing tips, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button. Again, I'm Joe Barclay. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you again soon.